Hey everybody, how are you guys doing? Long time no see, right? I have a weird, a weird sinister look on me right now. Um, <laughs> people who follow me will be, will laugh. I'm going to take a picture of how I have one of these lights set up just for the kicks of it. I hope you guys are doing well. Um, and I hope I'm not driving you crazy, but I feel like I, I feel like you guys are excited to see it and that excites me. So I want to wait until somebody jumps on because again, those Facebook trash issues. There we go. Hey, hey Debbie, how's it going? Hey Kelly, yay. Okay, great. So, um, like I have mentioned several times before, when my um, food service items, my, my kitchen and table wares are not in food service use, um, I use them for home decor, and it's really actually super fun. Um, I'm typically speaking, like my mom's crafty. She made me do crafts with her, but I wasn't never really crafty. Well, here is the cheat code to looking super crafty, you guys. <laughs> here it is. Um, like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna kind of cross um, over, and you'll see why in just a second. Um, because these a lot of these items um, are kitchen and table wares but they will definitely double as home decor. This is my favorite little bowl. I've been tickled to death since April of 2021 <laughs> that I own this. It is so precious. It is a small, um, it's a, we have three lines of um, service wear table settings. And we, one's the grace and gratitude, one is simply elegant, and one is enamel wear. And this is the grace and gratitude, and this has all the it has the beading, um, the filigree beading. It has a blush interior on the inside. My child has, been, has dried roses for me in there. But this is definitely, I definitely see this as a home decor piece. Or, um, it's this is really truly what it is. It is, I feel like this is something your grandmama went on. It's something very super nostalgic about everything, grace and gratitude. So it's like something your grandmama went on with a little bit of panache and then um, it would either be by the door with starlight mints or it'd be in a curio cabinet and nobody could touch it. So this is the Grace and Gratitude um, small pedestal bowl. And it has a whole family. A whole family. Here is the uh, Put on Love jewelry tree. And um, this, I own, we have three, there's, I have two daughters, right? So we have three of these. This one unfortunately took a tumble. It, there was no reasonable, <laughs> there was no reasonable um, expectation of it to have survived. So um, my daughter was sad about it. So I was like, just go trade the one outside. So, but the on the bottom of this wooden, this is acacia wood, and on the bottom it says "Put on Love Collosion 314." So I think it's very cool and it's very Mary and Martha to have. Um, added a scripture that reminds you um, like when you're putting on jewelry like the last thing you're putting on for the day the last thing you're putting on for your outfits and it reminds you to put on your love put on love the last thing so i think that is a really cool item um obviously because i have three of them um here is another crossover item and i have honestly never seen this be used as a picture <laughs> it's just really pretty like it's a ceramic this is the Simply Elegant line. So the Simply Elegant line has the contrasting grays. So this is a, um, it's really off-white and then a gray um, bottom. And it's known for that texture that it has. And it says blessed across it. So this is some, see, this is what, the, this is the cheat code to craft, you guys. Everybody's like, oh my gosh, you're so crafty. Look, I mean, look, I'm on a live video arranging the flowers again. <laughs> But this Simply Elegant picture, the pictures are probably the best sellers out of, um, so we have a Grace and Gratitude and a Simply Elegant picture that are both gorgeous. Gorgeous. And there is a kind of a um, back and forth between what is better, the what which one is the um, top seller, and usually it's Grace and Gratitude. I don't have that one yet. Um, these guys, these little reed diffusers, y'all, are amazing. Um, I'm sorry I don't have one to show you with the re I have the reeds right here but it doesn't come with the flower it does not come with the flower the flower I got from a Scentsy buddy when they were on sale because it's really pretty and it's really pretty but the reed diffusers that come with it they I always forget with 
um, reed diffusers that they get stronger. Like the more you flip up, the more you flip your reeds in there, they get stronger and stronger. So you don't really go nose blind to them. These are amazing. Hope smells amazing. Mint, herb, and essential oils. So these are all essential oil um, based uh, products, and they're with the reed diffusers, though, guys. Don't they're not going to come with that flower. Um, here is my well, I'm not even going to say it's my biggest piece because it's not. Here is my 22 inch Lazy Susan. And when I first um, saw this, I was like, I do not have room for that. What am I thinking? When I first saw this, I really did think, I was like, this is way too big. But this message spoke to me, you guys. It's so beautiful. It says, may your table be a place of plenty, a place to share, a place for love. And of course, it's got the natural stained wood and that gold leaf sure doesn't hurt a thing, right? It is super gorgeous. And um, what my spoiled, spoiled tail does now, <laughs> But honestly, if you um, feel like you lack the counter space or you lack the table space, first of all, it makes a gorgeous centerpiece when you're not. You can even have a bouquet and then serve food around it. But it just simplifies. If you have one corner that you don't use the back of, put that put a Lazy Susan in there and um, it um, creates more surface area for you, right? And I um, hope that I mentioned this already that um, I was in the hospitality industry for roughly 150 years <laughs> but um, we always use height to display food and I have had a great time using height in our home decor and so that's where those pedestals the grace and gratitude pedestals come into play um, so those are super fun this is our 16 inch enjoy life lazy Susan I adore this thing. This thing is perfect. This, they, to be honest, the 22 inch Lazy Susan lives on my desk outside out here. And a third of it, my laptop sits on. A third of it, my phone stand is on. And a third of it, my planner is on. That's how rotten we are. I'd marry a Martha. Um, but this is the Enjoy Life Lazy Susan. Again, if you're um, space conscious, this is something you can't afford to, like, to not have. It's really amazing. Uh, it's really beautiful. It's acacia wood too, but it's a whitewashed acacia. And it has these leaves imprinted. And the message on this is God blesses us with everything we need to enjoy life. 1 Timothy 6.17. So this is really is a gorgeous piece. Um, and we have a um, caddy that goes with it as well. So I am going to build... Oh, I meant to highlight this first. And I forgot the, the small pedestal bowl guys it has my attention always has my attention this is so mary and martha this came out with the new fall catalog and we got them in our conference boxes but this is called the giving plate and this and i'll tell you why i'm mixing it in with home decor is because it says the giving plate what better way to act upon his will for us to care than cooking up some tasty treats especially to share just flip the plate and sign your name. You'll see where it has been. Then fill it up again with food and love and pass it on again. And it says, God loves people who love to give on it. I think this is a super cool concept and um, one of the best Christmas ideas ever. Because it will never, you know, it just never stops into, I mean, you might get it back again. You never know. I would definitely, I'm definitely getting several of those. There'll be several family members getting those. Shh. Don't tell them. Don't tell them. So just because these are here, I'm going to show you because they're in my because they're in my metal basket that I want to. Um, the, this is the grace and gratitude. Um, this is the accent plate. The blush is the accent plate, and the bottom plate is the dinner plate. So this the accent plate has the Queen Anne's lace around it, the raised edges. So this is grace and gratitude again with the blush color they also have the cream color they also have this um, accent plate in this cream color but it still has the um, queen anne's lace on it and on the back of every piece of silverware of a serviceware we have is a, um, a scripture so for grace and gratitude it is our God, we thank you and praise your glorious name. 1 Chronicles 29, 13. 
This is for the little things, for the big things, for all the things. And it carries on. I'm going to show you this really quickly as well, too. And move along. So this one, this is the Grace and Gratitude um, dinner plate. And it says, grateful for his blessings, thankful for his grace on the front of it there. And this is just super gorgeous. Again, it has... Um, our God, we thank you and praise you for his name, one chronicle. And that is, it says it has the beating, just like the, um, the small pedestal bowl did as well. Oh, I was looking for the great gratitude mug. Well, well, we'll just have to move on, won't we? Here are these bud faces that are, when I saw these in the catalog, I was like, mm hmm what is so great now that i have them i'm like oh, these are gorgeous they have the leather strap on the outside of them you can you literally use them for anything you ever wanted like a beta like a beta fish could go in here but it says this one says bloom in his joy these come as a set of three Bloom. get back on there and then medium one says abide in his love and this one says grow in grace these are super cute super cute set um and again i wish we were in person gathering um face to face and because if this stuff was in your hands you'd be as thrilled as i am because they are really great okay and then we have we have two sets of planners um these are 36 dollars, and the other set is a set of four and they're 48 dollars, so they're 12 dollars a piece so it kind of depends on what um style you want and um these are the newest edition their faith hope and joy is what they say on them and they are more of like a dark dark gray almost black and white um so it is really pretty you can do a lot of things with these too i have um you know, the reason i can't show you the other set is because they're filled with pencils and crayons for my kids desk uh, this is where yet where yet there the hope it has leaves and again this is the set of three so this one's really cute um i love the first set. i love the um four set the four piece set the um, plant love plant love bloom grow <laughs> set um these are really pretty really really pretty too this one says faith on it so they have it's similar but different designs on them and they are stunners so if you want to um you want people to stop on your front porch if you want to praise his name you want to sing his praises from your front porch that's the way to do it and again just because these are in our hand my hand i'm going to go ahead and show you these these are from our enamelware collection and these are there's a big spoon and a spork Eileen loves it when I say spork, but this is a serving fork, right? So they're all natural stained wood. Um, this one says love on it, and the and the um, scripture surrounding um, the enamelware collection is Acts two forty six. We broke bread, glorious heart. Um, so this one acts, and this one says serve on it. So these are great little pieces to have too, um, and they're just, they're just gorgeous. They're just something that nobody else really makes, and I feel like that with a lot, lot, lot of love. Mary Martha said. Okay, here is the simply elegant dinner plate. It's a gray. It has the lines on it as well. And um, if it were me picking out a play setting right now, I would mix it up. I would mix them all up. I would mix this. I mean, we are, there's three girls and one man who lives here, so he doesn't really care. He's used to it. <laughs> but this pink and gray is stunning. Am I wrong? It is so, it is really, really gorgeous together, and I love it. Um, so I would mix it all up. If I, um, I don't think, you know, there's never really, there's not a need yet for us to have. We're a family of four. For us to have a four-piece table setting, but if it was, it would be all mixed up. Everybody would get to choose what their face setting would be. Right, here is one of my newest favorite items right here. 
this metal basket and I just pulled all that stuff out of it so it does look a little bit bare but it is gorgeous and it's huge everything when you when you get your Mary and Martha items you're gonna be like what did I order <laughs> every single time I get a delivery I'm like what did I order but here is the Grace of Peace metal box. It's gold. And then it has these little leather handles on it. Again, you guys, this is Hallmark quality stuff. I have loaded this like literally full of like 70 pounds of stuff and carried it to my grandmother's house and did a photo shoot in my grandmother's doll house. Um, I have done a lot of things with this. Um, and it here she is, Steady Eddie. It's been on my porch. It stayed on my porch for um a couple of weeks it, it's been it's been through some stuff and it looks as good as the day I took it out of the box and it, this one has a uh, partner and it's the be still basket and that one is in that one's in my bedroom with too much stuff in it to get on it to be honest so that one is a shorter wider um, metal box and it is so I mean it's on point stylish it's great it is great. All right, this this was in last year's catalog, and then um, for the spring summer catalog, it did it come into focus? Yeah. Um, for the spring summer, like I, I know I'm only five, I'm only five two, you guys, but this thing is glorious and huge. <laughs> but it is um, it is John one fourteen. So, I mean, in, in the comments, tell me whether you'd leave this up all year round or just for Christmas. Because I totally, I had to go, I had to pull it off my wall to show it to you guys right now. So it says, so the word became human and made his home among us. He was full of unfailing love and faithfulness. And we have seen his glory, the glory of the Father's one and only Son. This is an amazing mantle top piece. This is a great piece for above your bed. It is large and in charge. So this just came back out in the um, fall winter catalog. Um, it's something I really love too. So here, it's really hard, you guys. It's really hard to pick a favorite item. Here is the mango wood cross. Again, I'm only five two, <laughs> so it is. It is a large um, wooden cross. This is also a customer special this month. So if you um, spend $35 in retail, you unlock a special price on this. This item, very cool. Um, so this is mango wood and it has a slight, slight whitewash on it, but it is hand carved, it is glorious. And it is Mar Mary Martha um, branded, but it is Hallmark made. So it is one of the most, um, Definitely one of the most treasured home pieces that I own. So here, I only have two more things to show you, and then I'm gonna leave you alone. Here's a Girl in Grease um, planner box that you get for free if you um, just get grab a link for one of us. In August, Mary and Martha is giving away a um, planter of this planter box to anyone who has a $200 party, $200 gathering, and and honestly, it really isn't that hard we can make you a link to put in this event, like several people already have, um, and you can invite friends to this event and kind of tag them where you'd like them to see, or um, you could, you know, you don't, you don't have to be super public if that's not your thing. You don't have to be super public about um, sharing your link. You can just share it to your closest friends and family and relatives. So here is definitely like the drum roll please. This is definitely the most, my the best seller, my personal best seller, um, is the 16 inch Gracious Home Charcuterie Board. Okay, and I know you're like, why is this in home decor? I have used this as the base of literally everything. I don't know what I used as a photo backdrop before I got this. I don't know what I used as a base for anything, um, but I use this definitely to create that height here you go. This is just the medium grease and gratitude pedestal too. But you could do use that, use it to create that height. And actually I posted that Easter picture 
the bunnies were on top the bunny ears were on top of this if you want to go back and look at it but um the, this is the medium grease and gratitude pedestal it's super cute too and it says but I, again i use it i use them for home decor this one says thank thankful for simple grease thankful for simple graces on it but that height um, gives you a lot more service surface area or a decor area and you can really jush it up and again cheat code to look and crafty cheat code to look and crafty so my charcuterie board is uh, over a year old so it's got and it's really actually kind of cool to have the have little memories that are on it there's a little gold little gold piece that got rubbed against something so it has little memories on it so um very it's a very sturdy piece though it's been a lot of places done a lot of things on the bottom it says a gracious home is a place of peace and it a gracious home is a place of peace uh, and it says my people will dwell in a place of peace on the back of it so this has definitely been my personal bestseller People really love these, and they're great for um, when you store them. Like, you can't not store them in a place that's glorious. You know, if you put it up against the, you know, your kitchen backsplash, people love it. And um, why? You, what, my leader, my leader says, even if the plumber comes into your house that day and sees your charcuterie board, he got the word of Jesus, a little bit of word, um, in his mind that day. Which is really, um, it might sound very simple, and it did to me at first too, but it is, um, whoa, a mind changer when you can really get, when you can just really click somebody into thinking um, God-like thoughts is a very powerful, powerful thing. So, um, I have, let's pull an encouragement card because that's, that's the way I live. And I will sign off. And if you guys let do let me know. We do full over full service checkouts too. So if you I pulled two, so now I had to read two. But if you need any help at all or you need a link to something, please reach out in the comments wherever. If you don't know who your consultant is, be you know, just say, Yo, Kathleen, who's my consultant, and I'll be more than happy to point you in her direction. But here is our encouragement cards for the night. The Lord will fight for you, and you have only to keep still. Yes, I need to hear that. Did you guys need to hear that? The Lord will fight for you, and you have only to keep still. Exodus 14, 14. Good stuff. I need to hear that. Oh, I like I haven't pulled this card before, but um, I know Corinthians 2. So this says, no eye has seen. No ear has heard, and no mind has imagined what God has prepared for those who love Him. No eye has seen it. So those are a little bit of um, a little taste of home decor, and even a little taste of kitchen um, kitchen wares that I use as home decor. Those it's kind of um, my favorite categories are kitchen and table wares, and it's just and the our book and Bible very close tie between those two. I think there's a ton of power in um, both. Um, my daughter was born with a brain tumor, born, born with a brain tumor. So I am a little bit mad at that this is this disposable um, culture we're living in. So if I think you, if, I think if you had something you're really proud of to take with you to serve on, that you'll be much less likely to go out and grab those disposable items and throw them away and fill us up a trash island and we'll just all be, uh, which I'll be petroleum eventually. <laughs> ah, funny, not funny. But seriously. But that's, uh, I think there's a lot of power in that. But those, uh, the book and Bible resources, are some powerful, powerful tools to change your mind and change your perspective and change um, your mindset into a kingdom mindset. And there is that is no joke. <laughs> it is amazing what those books can do. God bless you guys. Thanks for sticking with me. And I will see you soon. Bye.